And it's a case we've been following for five years now. Today, jurors have found former Houston police narcotics officer Gerald Goins guilty of felony murder. Fox 26's Domley Keith is live at the Harris County Criminal Courthouse where the former officer learned his fate this afternoon. Domley. Yeah, after deliberating for about seven hours total yesterday and today, jurors found ex-HPD narcotics officer Gerald Goins guilty of two counts of felony murder for the deaths of Regina Nicholas and Dennis Tuttle in 2019 inside their own home. Ex-Houston Police Narcotics Officer Gerald Goins appears to say a silent prayer as Judge Veronica Nelson reads the verdict. We, the jury, find the defendant, Gerald Goins, guilty of felony murder as charged. Goins appears to mouth, wow. That deadly no-knock warrant that ended the lives of Regina Nicholas and Dennis Tuttle also ended the career of the veteran officer, and now he could spend the rest of his life behind bars. Goins is convicted of felony murder after lying to a judge to secure a drug search warrant of the couple's Harding Street home. Jurors clearly believed two weeks of testimony put on by prosecutors saying if not for that warrant, no one would have died. Four officers, including Goins, were also shot. Officer Sidel Lovings, here in an HPOU benefit flyer with his family, was left paralyzed. During the punishment phase, a lot more evidence could be presented against Goins, including the dozens and dozens of drug cases connected to him that were looked into and many were overturned by the Harris County District Attorney's Office, including a charge against George Floyd in a case where Goins arrested Floyd back in 2004. Goins had been out of jail on bond, but once found guilty, deputies moved in to take him into custody. There was a heated exchange as defense attorney Max Seacrest asked them to wait until the jury left the courtroom. Now, Nicholas and Tuttle's loved ones hugged one another after the verdict was read. Sentencing begins tomorrow morning. Reporting live from the Harris County Criminal Courthouse, I'm Domalee Keith, Fox 26 News.